because they are miles in front. Welcome back everyone. It is the last final of the day. It's the rookie peas. And I <laughs> just Louis Brown nearly went on the grass. Well he did go on the grass. He was looking around, they've all gone way too fast. We're gonna get one more lap because he didn't know to slow it down. <laughs> they just all took off. So Cal Creed, the pole sitter. Hang on, they've gone hammer time again. Slow it down, kids, slow it down. <laughs> Cal's still trying to catch up. So come on, Carl, give it some hammer. He's hammering it just to catch him. All right, round we go there. Let me make some introductions. It is the last final of the day. We should have some fun with the kids. It's the rookie pea platers from the front. Queenslanders, Carl Creed and Louis Brown. Off the second row, Yamuna Sternbeck for Queensland and Daisy Smith for New South Wales. If you're gonna support them, shake your hands in the air like you just don't care. Or if you're a man, shake your booty. I don't care, just give it some jandal. Round they come, Louis Brown this time misses the grass and keeps it on the brown stuff, the, the gray stuff. Here we go then, they have 18 laps in which to slug it out for the Young Guns title. Do we go green, light, racing? Yes we do! And Louis Brown tried to go through. Oh, no, Daisy gets balked and goes sideways. A little bit of drift action for Daisy Smith. And she has to bring it back on track and straighten it up. Meanwhile, out front, Creed has gone away. Louis Brown's gone with him. Up the hill they go. What can Louis do this time? Carl Creed will try and stay right there. Sternbeck is in pursuit. Down the hill they come, over the start finish line, and Carl Creed, he's gone, huge into this one. He's put the afterburners on, and he's giving it some jandal. Creed, Brown, and Smith are the only ones showing on timing. Oh no, Sternbeck is still not showing on timing. What is wrong with the timer? Poor old Sternbeck, your moon has caught. It's not working on the timing. I know it's on there, but it's not working. So still, Creed, Brown, Sternbeck, and Daisy Smith go over the line. Round they go. Not sure what's going on with Sternbeck's transponder, but it's not working yet again. Up the hill they come, back towards me, and we've got your flyer, Carl Creed. Giving it some jandle in the front with Louis Brown in pursuit. Up the hill they go. Plenty of laps left yet in this. Remember, we've had some really big shocks already. Don't count it out yet in this one. Don't count your eggs before they've hatched because anything can happen in car racing. Down they go into the Power Republic hairpin. Up the hill they will come. Creed, Brown and Smith show on timing. Sternbeck it is though, in third on track. The second time this happened, don't know why. Sternbeck continues through. Up into the super cheap auto rise. The little number 14 continues on. Meanwhile, Carl Creed comes round Chaos Corner. Heads down the start finish rate into energy course to left hander. Four laps done, 14 to go. Up the hill they come, still Carl Creed hanging on at the front. Looks like it's gonna be comfortable at the moment because little Harry Brown doesn't have an, Louis Brown, sorry, doesn't have an answer at the moment. Just watching if these times do start to creep down. That time round, Louis was slower. The one before he was quicker. He needs the consistency, he's got to get it together. Through they go, through energy course, down they go into the Power Republic hairpin, back up towards us they come now. And they go into the Andrew Thompson straight away, now they're into Anglo Sports, the right-hander. Still Carl Creed hanging on, the gap last time round was 0.798. Creed to Brown, what is it this time? We'll watch it as they come over the line right now. Creed will come over first. 0.798 last time round. What is it this time? 
3.827, he's eking away, one tenth per lap. Over the line goes Daisy. Daisy Smith still hammering it round there, down towards the Pirate Public hairpin, but back up towards me, Carl Creed, already into the super cheap auto rise, for another lap to be completed now, down the Kirsty Graham Memorial Strait, into Chaos Corner, past the grandstand they go. Through the grandstand and into the left-hander. Down towards Power Republic Air Pit. Oh, that gap is growing. 0.938 now. Carl Creed, he's going away from them. Creed is getting away with 11 laps to go. Sternbeck continues on, but Creed looks very comfortable. Louis Brown doing all he can. Through goes Sternbeck. Here comes Daisy Smith up the hill through the Anglo Motorsports right-hander. Daisy hanging on to the energy cart, through, up the hill, the P player, the number seven, through super cheap. Down the Kirsty Gray Memorial straight away, into the chaos corner, the hairpin back on herself. Past the start finish line and past the grandstand, into the energy course left-hander, while the leaders come back towards me, Carl Creed, up the hill, down the hill. Heading towards Chaos Corner, the hairpin now. And still, Louis Brown cannot close that gap. It's gone out to 1.22. Louis Brown cannot hang on. Carl Creed is flying. Sternbeck still third on track. Nothing on timing. Continues on. There will be a debate about transponders after this one. Sternbeck in the meantime continues third place on track holding a very comfortable third as well up the hill into super cheap now down the hill they go down into chaos and here comes Creed over the line into eight laps left single digits to go to the end of this meeting and the end of this rookie p-play final in the Lismore Young Guns titles. Round comes Carl Creed, still hammer time through there. Louis Brown still going to. Up the hill into Super Cheap Auto they go. Down the Kirsty Gray Memorial Strait into Chaos Corner. That will leave just seven to go. Seven laps left for Carl Creed. When we spoke to him this morning, he was very confident indeed. Sternberg goes through. Into the Power Republic hairpin, they've all gone. What can Yamuna do? Can Yamuna Sternbeck get any quicker, get closer? With the six laps left and Louis Brown. Sternbeck now comes back towards me and up the hill, the flying number 14. Into the Kirsty Graham Memorial Strait and down through Chaos Corner. There are just seven to go. Whoa, the car starts to sound a little bit shaky there as Daisy Smith goes up the hill. Back towards me though, here comes the flyer, Carl Creed. Absolutely had it all his own way all weekend long. Carl Creed having a cracker final. Has to hold it together for five more laps after this one. We're on the countdown. We're into five to go. Over the line, Carl Creed through the energy course left-hander. Down to the Power Republic hairpin they go. Now they'll head back up the hill. And on to the Andrew Thompson main straight away they come. Through the Anglo Motorsports right-hander, Creed goes through. Brown's gonna come through. Next up it will be Sternbeck comes through. And Daisy Smith heads through. Energy course, the left-hander, down towards the Power Republic hairpin. And up the Andrew Thompson straight away now. Here comes Daisy Smith. Four to go, three after this one, remember? Through goes Daisy in the number seven energy cart. And here comes the leader, Carl Creed. Oh, Carl nearly lost it. Boy, oh boy. Heart attack time. They hit the curb. The car launched 
He managed to bring it back, but boy, oh boy, that very nearly came unstuck. Goodness me, just when you think there could be dramas, he very nearly lost it. Let's hope he's not damaged that car. He's got a four second lead, four and a half second lead. And up the hill he comes through the Andrew Thompson main straightaway onto Anglo Motorsports. He doesn't go as quick this time through there. Takes it a bit more gingerly, up super cheap. Down the hill through Kirsty Graham. He's catching Daisy Smith. I don't think he's gonna lap her by the end of this race. There are two to go. He will get the last lap board next time round. Daisy Smith is just in front of him. But Carl Creed has had an unbelievable weekend. The novice rookie brings it round through Anglo Motorsports and up to Super Cheap Auto to complete the penultimate lap. Down he goes into Chaos Corner. The last lap board is about to be shown. We have one lap of racing left today. And it's going to be down to your man, Carl Creed, to finish it off. Through the Power Republic hairpin. Up the hill he comes. Sternbeck goes through. Louis Brown's gone through. Here comes Daisy Smith. And here comes Carl Creed. And it is Young Guns 2019 Lismore Car Club karting New South Wales. The rookie P plate winner, winner, chicken dinner, Carl Creed. Second, it will be your man, Louis Brown. Fist pump. Third on track, it is Yamuna Sternbeck. And fourth on track, here comes Daisy Smith. Give it up for Daisy when she comes round. Daisy comes down, Kirsty Graham. Fourth on track, third on timing, the number seven, Daisy Smith. <laughs>